Thank you for tuning in to Dub World. Today is the second video in this series coming from the No Do VW show in Port Orange, Florida. We're finishing up our series on Brazilian VWs. If you're ready for more, sit back and let's go. So we are doing unique VWs today, and this is a VW 1600L, which is a Brazilian VW, kind of like a Type 3. Very cool, four-door. Things look really comfortable inside. I'd like to take one for a ride. Front end is kind of bizarre looking. If it didn't have a VW emblem, I doubt anybody would guess it was a Volkswagen from the front. And I'm sorry I didn't get to video the engine, but this does have an upright Type 1 engine in the back like you'd see in a Beetle. So even though the body resembles more of a Type 3 Volkswagen, it definitely shares Type 1 parts as well. All in all, a very cool ride. Well, my friends, continuation of the Brazilian VWs, we have a Gaul. In case you've never heard of a Gaul, this is actually the predecessor to the Volkswagen Fox here in America. Anyways, the Gaul is a fastback version of the Fox. And really, this is the closest uh, Beetle ancestor because if you check this out, these cars, when they first came out, actually have an air-cooled engine. So they started out as an air-cooled car and then went to being water-cooled front-wheel drive. So they had the Gaul, which is the fastback, mm -hmm. and they also had a coupe, and they had a wagon, and they had a pickup truck. Now, each one of them is named a different model, but very cool to see these Brazilian VWs making it here to the U.S. now. Before we go, I'm going to share a photo of a couple of unique Brazilian VWs, and those VWs are called SP2s. You see them right here. This was Volkswagen sports car in Brazil. Unfortunately, I didn't get to see them at the show because they showed up late after I'd already been to this area. Well, that's it for today's video. I'll be posting more soon. Thank you as always for tuning in. See you next time on Double Road.